This is a Rainbow Workbook lesson for English First Additional Language, Grade 4, Term 3, Lessons 69, 70, 71, and 72. In this lesson, the topics of focus are reading and writing a book review. Reading time! Hello everybody! We are going to read a recipe for making a sandwich. This recipe is for a ham sandwich. Group 1 will read the list of ingredients needed for the sandwich and Group 2 will read the method of how to make the sandwich. Let's read the title of the recipe. Healthy Ham Sandwich Great! Now Group 1 will read the ingredients. Two slices of brown bread Butter, one piece of ham, lettuce, two slices of tomato, four slices of cucumber. Excellent! Now group two will read the method. Let's begin. One, use bread, lettuce, tomato and cucumber that has already been cut. If it has not been cut, then ask an adult to help you. Two. Place two slices of bread next to each other. 3. Use a blunt knife to spread some butter on each slice of bread. 4. Place the ham, lettuce, tomato and cucumber on one of the slices of bread. 5. Put the other slice of bread on top. 6. Your sandwich is complete. Eat and enjoy. Lovely reading! That sounds like a delicious sandwich. What other kinds of sandwiches do you like? Wordplay Hi everyone! Listen to some sentences and copy what you hear. Have a pencil and a piece of paper ready so you can draw when you are asked to. Listen to the first sentence. Speech bubbles are used in cartoons. The speech bubbles show us who is talking. Say, speech bubbles are used in cartoons. Yes, watch your teacher draw a boy saying something in a speech bubble. Then draw your own picture of someone saying something in a speech bubble. Nice! Listen to another sentence now. Plurals are when there are more than one of something. For example, one dog, two dogs. Say, one dog, two dogs. Good! Draw two dogs on your piece of paper. Great! Listen again. An author is someone who writes a story. Say, the author wrote a funny book about clowns. Yes! Books normally have a picture on the cover. The book cover is carefully designed to make people want to read the book. Say, the book cover was bright and colourful. Well done, Grade 4s! Sentence play We are going to decide if the sentence is in the past tense or not. Let's see if you can help me. Listen carefully. Is this sentence in the past tense? The alarm makes a beeping sound. That's right. It's not. It is in the present tense. It should have said, the alarm made a beeping sound. Say, the alarm made a beeping sound. Let's try this one now. 
They played netball on Saturday. Is that sentence in the past tense? Yes, it is in the past tense. Well done. How about this one? Nomsa rides her bike very fast. You've got it. That was in the present tense. How do we change it to the past tense? Let's say Nomsa rode her bike very fast. Super work! Keep practicing your present and past tenses. Sound play. We are going to listen to the ch sound in this lesson. The ch sound can be at the beginning or at the end of words. In the word church, it has it at the beginning and at the end. Say ch, er, ch, church. Listen and repeat these words. Cheap. Chocolate. Change. Choose. Good. Let's look at some words that have that ch at the end. Say, bench. Yes, listen to these ch words and repeat them. Such. Much. Bunch. Lunch. Well done. Now let's say a sentence with some ch words. Say, the rich man will watch the match. Terrific. Can you think of a sentence with the words chocolate and cheap? Okay, let's add the word change to those words. I bought a cheap chocolate and I got five rand change. Say that now, please. I bought a cheap chocolate and I got five rand change. You've got it. Well done. Playtime. Let's get started with our game called What Is It? Listen carefully and try to guess what food is being described. Think of your own foods to describe. This is the first one. It begins with the letter I and it is cold and delicious. What is it? Super! It is ice cream. Listen again. It begins with the letter S, and bread and butter are part of it. What is it? That's right. It is a sandwich. Here is another one. It begins with the letter P. It grows underground. You can mash it or eat it whole. What is it? Potatoes! You are doing so well!